Hey, good morning. I'm in Bend, Oregon, the Chutes River. I'm doing a morning run instead of snowboarding right now because there's no snow, bachelor's closed, which, you know, sucks, but make the best of it and it gives me opportunity to do some videos like this one. So I just wanted to say hi. And um, also like, you know, somebody I talked to recently that I really love and care about was saying how they were struggling with anxiety. And, um, you know, I know from my own experience with anxiety, I had social anxiety and depression and all that stuff, or so I thought. But um, really it was not understanding how the mind works and like the thoughts being offered to me, making me think something's wrong and then creating a feeling in my body uh, bringing up emotion from the past and really getting caught up in, in a in a cycle and a pattern and still that comes back to this day it's really interesting is that's always kind of offered it always kind of come back but um, what I wanted to share is like just how powerful it is to like know that everybody has that even Jesus even Gandhi even Buddha they all had a mind that would race and try to pull them away from the now moment try to keep them safe and protected projecting into the future or the past and that's what anxiety is really is you're projecting into a future that you can't possibly know and really it's whenever we feel fear or anxiety it's an opportunity to come present like fear lets us know okay i got to be present breathe notice so try it it works and then the breath you want to do is really simple First, you just tune into how you're breathing and you just notice. And in that noticing, you start to influence and change the breath. And so the best way I know to first work on the belly breaths and increase in our uh, lung capacity and also the movement of the body and the uh, diaphragmatic breathing is to lay down. So I always recommend uh, like first thing in the morning or right before bed, doing 10 deep conscious breaths, breathing in through the nose releasing out through the mouth and basically we're filling the belly filling the belly up into the chest and then releasing and it's almost like a wave it goes back down and it's immediately in immediately out for 10 and then the very last one breathing really deep as deep as you can and then releasing all the air out and just letting and not not like a tense holding like oh I got to squeeze everything out it's just letting everything out and then just hold and notice for about a minute and then just breathe normally and you may find you want to keep doing the breathing and that's when it starts to get fun this, the more you do this the easier it gets to breathe and the more you breathe as you speak and the more you breathe as you're waiting in line at the store the more you breathe when people are stressed out around you or you're stressed out you're like oh yeah breathe and you realize how shallow you're breathing and then as you breathe you're like oh shit everything's okay you know there's no tiger here there's nothing really that bad going on and if there is, you're like, you're going to have the oxygen, you're going to have the power, and you're going to have the presence to be like, all right, this is what we're going to do. And so um, I wanted to share that. And I hope you're all having an amazing day. And I'll catch you all later. Aloha.